pretty well that matchup. So like, I mean, Kazuo's really good. So I don't know. It's an interesting know matchup because you know, uh, since Nana's shield comes up uh, after Popo's, uh -huh. it, if you kick, it's pretty much like a free kick on Nana. Every really? Time. That's interesting. So. Go. Yeah, we got Zelda. Oh. Like, I wonder if... Uh, it's wobbling legal? This? Yes. Yeah. So, I mean, it's... I think that, that pretty much hits no matter what. Yeah. I think Nintendo has to play a lot safer than uh, Lake does. Really? Yeah. Despite like the the chain grabs, wow. That was awesome. The, <laughs> despite like the chain grabs wobbling and stuff. Like, oh wow. Yeah, because like, those geez. kicks are just so disruptive to you know to ice climber style. Yeah. And Zelda's down smash is actually the fastest down smash in the game. It comes out in like, really? frame three. Oh wow! I don't know. That. So crash cancel down smash is really good at like you know getting a out. Um, yeah, Tendu's struggling a good bit this match. Yeah, I don't think. I mean, if he gets a wobble, it'll you know it'll change things. Yeah, definitely. But Nintendo's definitely afraid of the kick, and you should yeah. be. I mean, is it 78 off of like what three kicks in the down smash? Dang. Yep. Keeps managing to separate. Ice tower's is pretty. Uh, uh, like, this matchup is, you know, like one of those soft counters that just... Ice Climbers really can't do much against it. Uh, it seems like it feels really difficult to, like, hit Zelda's shield. Wow. All right, so this is this is not looking good for Nintendo. Oh, man. Um, oh! Wow. Uh, oh, my God. That's my man. teammate. That's my teammate. <laughs> <laughs> I got a root for Nintendo. He's he's from Maryland. Yeah. Well, nowadays he is. Uh, so I mean, uh, it's good that we're uh, commentating. Yeah. yeah. One for each. Yeah. The lake's awesome, dude. It's, it's hilarious. The Nintendo also plays Peach, right? Yeah, he has a Peach. That's probably his second best character. Now he's sticking with Ices. I. Uh, yeah, maybe. Like... I guess he feels confident that he could, you know, bring it back on a bigger stage. He has I... more room to run around. But it. it... I guess he's hoping to like survive more, but yeah, survive more and maybe like give himself a few more chances to get grabs in. It's interesting. Like, I mean, I, I imagine I know like Nintendo probably doesn't have like Zelda experience, but I can't imagine. I don't know of any Lace powers in this area, I, as far as I remember. Aaron, uh, Aaron, the lake is. We don't. We used to have it. We used to have hockey. Hockey, yeah. Yeah. Um, but, uh, uh, once he left, we we actually don't have an ICs in this area. But it's interesting because Lake is one of those players that can hit like he loves like the matchups and how all that works really? in the game. And how so? Even though we don't have a lot of you know characters to get this experience from. He still, he still knows like the little things to do in the matchups because he studied the game. Yeah. Because he, uh, oh my God. All right, so they're even. Teddy's at least doing better than the last match. I guess it's, <laughs> it's a adjustment period, but uh. There are a lot more blizzards. It's also I don't think I don't think Ices can actually. Wow, I didn't think that was a thing. This looks so difficult. <laughs> I, I just I don't even know what, what to say. Blizzard, Zelda can get a free kick. Yeah. Oh, that yeah. was so good. Zelda's also really hard to punish. Yeah. Because her... So like you're not very careful with how you hit hit them. Like he, she can like jump out and, and you know, hit you with the toe. Mm -hmm. Oh, here we go. Maybe. I, oh. Oh, messes it up. Yeah. 
Yeah, probably a little nervous because there's we've got quite a crowd going on here. Yeah, now. We've got about half the venue watching this. The crowd is definitely against against Nintendo. Yeah. But I mean, it's hometown advantage. So. Yeah. <laughs> Still, it's fairly even. It's like I think a lot of that has to do with the stage. It's a good pick. Yeah. Wow. Oh. Yeah. Like, it's. I don't know, because like she hits all her moves have a deceptive amount of hit, uh, like of sure. shield stun. Like more than you would think, or a lot more than you would think. Yeah, they almost feel like Ganon moves. Yeah, yeah. Like you know when Ganon hits you with a really meaty forward air, you can't just like wave dash out of shield immediately. You yeah, just sit and shield a little bit. I, I noticed that when we were playing the teams earlier, like I, I just I felt so unsafe yeah. trying to hit him. I was like, God, I'm gonna get towed, and I t I did over and over. Oh, all right. Tedu's on, his, and so, on his last stock here. Because of that, like, Zelda just gets a lot of... Oh, man. That's, that's, that's big. Yeah. The fact that Nintendo doesn't know yeah, the timing for that. Yeah, I wonder if... I mean, I, I wonder what he has as far as chain grabs. Like, I don't know if that's... If the only thing he has that's guaranteed is, is like, wobbling or something. I don't really know how that works, but... Yeah, that's... Uh, Oh, there you go. All right. still bring this, yeah, bring this back. Like, a, a lot of the normal icy tricks don't... Oh! Blake's still trying, still trying to mash out, but I guess as long as, as long as Ice Climbers doesn't mess up, it, yeah. it's like, you might as well put down the controller, unfortunately. Kind of, it's frustrating, but uh, we're just going to game three. I wonder if Nintendo might switch, though. I don't know. That that actually might have, you know, given them a little bit more boost of confidence in the yeah. In the matchup, that's true. So I feel like it depends on the stage. Like the first stage was Fountain, which I feel like might have been like a little too small for Nintendo yeah. stage. Yeah. He, he went to the biggest stage possible after that. It was kind of a middle ground, I guess. Again, so yeah. You notice one thing that Lake is doing, which is really kind of interesting, is the threat of the kick is enough sometimes mm. that just jumping at them. Is enough to you know put pressure on. Yeah, I yeah. mean, it's enough to like kind of make your opponent, uh, you know, second guess what he's you know his approach. Yeah. Uh, all right. Cause Zelda can like Zelda can get two kicks out on a short hop, so. Yeah. Ted has been struggling to, to like keep a lead. Or like he's mostly been behind this whole set in each of the matches. Yeah, like this this match was really interesting because I mean, what what do ICs do? Yeah. Like, Nana is just such a free kill. <laughs> wow. Oh. Uh, it's okay though, because Nana has a good amount of percent on her, so. Ooh. Oh my god, those kicks. So strong. <laughs> that force smash is really, really hard to get in and punish. Yeah. Wow. Uh, nearly died, but I don't know if he missed the DI or, or something. But. It's, it's just this scary wall of death off of those heels, man. Yeah. I feel like like ice, ice season them, like when they shield and they get hit, they just get pushed a little bit too far away. Yeah. They really punish. I was going to say, like, you know, like Ganon has a really good matchup against ice season. Oh, yeah. oh. Uh oh. Uh oh, he messes it up. For the third time he's messed up a grab so far. Like, that was the like, first time he messed up the wobble. Yeah. Like, that's, that's going to, like, make or break this set. Mm hmm. It's these grabs. Like, 
I don't know, maybe it's just lack of experience in the matchup, but it doesn't seem like Nintendo actually... Oh, wow. Oh! Uh, oh, that, that was... That was nice. Oh, that was so tricky. Uh-oh. Uh, uh, no, no, no. Should be a guaranteed stock, unfortunately. Yeah. I don't think he should... Um, should stay on the ground. I feel like... The, the, for the rest of the set, he's been, you know, in he's been in the air using platforms and all that kind of stuff. Yeah. And both times he's been wobbled, his, you know, approached off of the spawn. Oh, wow. So, you know, on the ground off of spawn. He's racking up a little bit of damage. Considering what's been taking, you know, like... What Nintendo's like really trying for? Mm. I don't feel. I don't think it really matters the like the percent as much as it does for Nintendo. Yeah. Like Zelda can take a few, can take a little extra percent. Mm. Oh, well. All right, last stock. This is this is intense. My heart's racing. <laughs> Good cover by Nintendo. He's looking bit hesitating a lot to approach. It seems like he's so limited with what he's, how he can approach Zelda. Oh, there it is. Oh man, I. <laughs> oh, man, I know I'm not supposed to be commentating, but oh my. It's hard. This is oh, so wow. tense. The Go either way. <laughs> it's the next kick. Oh, wow. That was a nice. No! Oh, wow. Way to go, Nintendo. Man, close stuff. Good game. That was so close. close. Damn. Uh -huh. It's a pretty good approach. It was he like shot the Nana kind of out and out yeah. over. Yeah. I don't know. And mm. it's you know this brings up a you know an interesting thing is like the whole discussion about like whether wobbling should be weak. Like the wobbling discussion is, I don't think it's ever gonna die. Yeah. Like people are, you know. Because that set would have been completely different. Yeah. Without that's wobbling. True. I don't know if he would have had like any kind of solid. Combo, throw combos. Yeah, because he didn't. He didn't have the experience. He didn't know the timing for it. So. Yeah. 